Hey folks, RC62. Just riding around today, doing a little vlogging, hopefully catching some video and uh, decent audio. I've added a little extra padding between the, uh, the shell and the sides of my helmet. Um, hopefully getting a little bit quieter uh, audio here. I've also uh, moved the microphone closer to my mouth so that uh, my voice should override most of the wind noise. We'll see. Railroad tracks, the bane of bikers everywhere. So I hope that uh, all my friends uh, in the northern states uh, are having a, a decent holiday weekend. Um, hopefully the weather is uh, cooperating a little bit with you, and I know it's probably going to be really cold, but uh, hopefully it won't be too wet or too, uh, too horrible for you to ride. I want you guys to get out there and uh, participate in that polar bear challenge. Uh, I'm looking to see some, uh, some videos from that. Uh, that looks like it's going to be a lot of fun. I'm hoping to participate. Um, really participate, not just uh, not just fake it with a uh, paper scientific thermometer. Um, but uh, yeah, I mean, that looks like it's going to be a whole heck of a lot of fun. And uh, if I get a cold enough weather here, I will definitely get out and ride. The cold weather doesn't scare me. Freezes me, yes. Scare me, no. Um, anyway, I think it'll be fun to bundle up. I mean, the good thing about riding in really cold weather is if uh, you put enough pairs of pants and shirts and jackets and whatever else on, I mean, it's kind of like additional protective gear. Uh, I know when I was a kid, I used to ride in freezing weather. Uh, my, my dad and I lived in Tuscaloosa, Alabama. And I would ride my little uh, Sears mini bike. Rain, shine, cold weather, hot weather, it didn't matter. When it was cold, I just put on about three or four pair of pants, some long johns, uh, I don't know how many shirts, a jacket. I had an old beat up helmet, which uh, was cracked. Uh, but I'd put that thing on and go riding. And uh, yeah, I, it was freezing, but uh, I don't know, you get out on your bike and uh, as long as you're not endangering yourself by risking hypothermia or uh, frostbite, uh, you know, riding in the cold can be a lot of fun. And I know on that little mini bike I wiped out several times and thank God I was wearing a lot of extra clothing because uh, I didn't get hurt. You know, it was more of a giggle. Um, but yeah, I mean, obviously I wasn't going 40 or 50 miles an hour, but still, you know, the principle applies. The, the more clothing you're wearing, the, uh, the more padded you are, so you're a little safer. But anyway, uh, I hope that those of you are, that are experiencing really cold weather will get out there and ride. Hopefully it'll be uh, a nice clear day, won't be wet, you won't have to worry about ice on the road. And, uh, you know, have some fun with it. Come on guys, get out there and start making some videos. My queue is empty. <laughs> I, need, I, need to, uh, I need to see you guys riding. <laughs>